I remember her. Not a girl, but the girl. The brains behind the all-time top ten comic book vixens only wish they could conjure a siren the likes of Susan Glenn. Beneath my feet, my own private earthquake registered an eight when Susan Glenn was near. In her presence, all that was beautiful before she arrived turned grotesque, and in her shadow, others became goblin-esque. If she approached, Susan Glenn didn't walk. She floated, accompanied by pyrotechnic spectacles that left me feeling a foot tall. She embodied every desirable quality I'd ever wanted. In my mind, I was a peasant before a queen. And so Susan Glenn and I were never a thing. If I could do it again, I'd do it differently.